Yo, what's going on? This your boy, Jay Sewell. Man, just came out of the gym and shit, man. Just got through, you know, good hour and a half workout. You know what I'm saying? Trying to lose some weight shit. Trying to lose, you know, about 20, maybe 30 pounds. Because, you know, I'm going to Vegas, you know, for the Canelo Cotto fight. You know what I'm saying? Going to make that drive from the town, you know, to Vegas. Make that eight-hour drive. But, you know, it's all good trying to get in shape and shit. But, you know, just so I could be looking fit and trim in Vegas, just in case, you know what I'm saying, I'll, you know, meet some nice, good-looking young ladies. You know what I'm saying? It's all good. But, um, anyway, man, I want to give my little prediction on the Leo Santa Cruz, Abner Marez fight. Um, first of all, man, I'm looking forward to this fight, man. I've been looking forward to it for a while, man, ever since it was uh, announced. Hopefully the winner out of this fates Galermo ringing down. Hopefully, you know, rumor has it that Ringo is gonna sign with Al Heyman as of uh, possibly the middle of September when his contract is up. Man, I hope that's true because man, if Al Heyman gets his hands on uh, Ringo, man, the possibilities, you know. So uh, hopefully that comes into fruition. Hope it does, man. Looking forward to it. But anyway, let me break down this fight, man. Um, as far as who I think is going to win, I know Abner Marez uh, has the experience. He's been around a little longer than Santa Cruz. But one thing Santa Cruz has, he does have a height advantage and possibly a reach advantage. You know, Abner Marez is a good boxer, but... You know, that Johnny Gonzalez fight where he got, like, flatlined in the first round? Wow. But, um, I'm going to go with Santa Cruz. You know, I, I am a Santa Cruz fan. I like the guy. I think he's an exciting boxer. And I've been on Leo Santa Cruz's case for a while, just like I was on uh, Gary Russell Jr.'s case for a while for them guys, you know, not fighting stellar competition. So... I give Leo Santa Cruz credit. Um, he got Al Heyman to make this fight. I'm looking forward to it. Um, my prediction is I'm going to take Leo Santa Cruz in a unanimous decision. Or possibly maybe a late stoppage. Just depends if he can work his jab, get inside, and pound Abner Morris. Both of these guys are defensively challenged both of these guys can be hit you know maybe maybe um abner marias to go back to the old abner marias if he gets in trouble maybe he just starts hitting santa cruz in the balls you know like he did a beko you know continuously hit him to slow slow him down but we'll see but anyway like i said that's my prediction i'm taking leo santa cruz in a unanimous decision or possibly a 11th round stoppage. I'm out.